Hello, good evening. Um, my name is Nurse Kaloy. I'm not a doctor, but I have uh, 32 years experience of being a nurse in California, Hawaii, and six years in Riyadh, Saudi Arabia. You must be wondering that I'm making this uh, reaction video uh, because this is something about uh, discrimination and insult, putting a uh, worker, manager at that into shame by uh, taking a video while interviewing or saying something to the manager. Okay, this incident happened in uh, Islamabad in Pakistan. Um, two owners, as they claim, they are the owner of uh, Kanoli in Islamabad. They said, "Oh, their name is uh, Usma and Dia." This is the uh, story or the situation. They went into the Kanoli restaurant, which is a prestigious prestigious or first class restaurant in Islamabad as I've known from a friend who is a Pakistani uh, the two ladies went into the restaurant and they said that they're like feeling bored so they called an employee which happens to be the manager and the manager of the restaurant name is Owes or Hoes something like that Anyways, the two ladies, I call them ladies as a respect, they said, they asked the manager how long she's been working with them. And the guy manager said nine years and points straight to the face of the manager. They asked the question, how many classes did you take uh, in English courses? So the manager answered six years, meaning uh, three courses in English, if I'm not mistaken. But anyways, they told the manager to say something or speak in English or say say a sentence and then the other lady said okay just introduce yourself so the poor guy the poor manager uh, spoke in English and he introduced himself in a broken English as he said I am he mentioned his name I do uh, something manager in this and then he just did a, a gesture and the two ladies start laughing and they said this is what we are paying for the salary they refer to the salary of the manager which meaning they're paying that manager a big amount as a manager but cannot speak English to me that is very very discriminatory and they could have done it in other proper way like talking to the manager in a private room or private venue and they should not be giving or doing a video putting that man or the guy manager into embarrassment okay they're putting that man into humiliation Oh my God, they asked the guy, how long have you been here working? Nine years. Why is it that they hired him in the, in the first place? And then suddenly they're ridiculing, ridiculing the guy, insulting him. That is not the way a manager should deal with the situation like this. As a professional or owner or manager, if you have the business ethics, 
then you should treat your employees the right way, not insulting them. There is a proper venue to correct a mistake for your employees. Okay? That's the fault of this manager. The hiring of these employees should be changed. If you are particular for the employees to know how to speak English, then from day one on the interview or application, they should already question if the patient or if the person knows how to speak English or basic English. If that's a requirement, then they should put that into the uh, questionnaire before they hire somebody else. But again, that is uncalled for for these two ladies because that is very, very improper as a business owner. That is embarrassing for you ladies. I'm doing this. I'm a Filipino U.S. Phil, um, we call it Filipino-American who lives in Hawaii. Okay? Uh, that is embarrassing. You cannot do that in U.S. or in any other country because that is discrimination, humiliation, putting that guy into embarrassment. That is very uncalled for, very improper for a, a boss, an owner, because there is always a proper venue and there's always a proper communication. If you think you are professional enough, you should treat your workforce, rank and file, the right way they should be treated as a human being. That's all. And thanks for watching. And please write down your comments and I will answer your queries. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Good night. And by the way, Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Good night, ladies and gentlemen. Bye-bye.